Hello, I'm Scott Brown with Green Wind and other home energies. Well, one of our YouTube users called Little Old Man well, asked me first for this and I decided to give it to him. Anyway, we're going to put a little alcohol in it. I sent it to him and basically it came back. And I had a problem. I couldn't figure out what the problem was with it. So, I played with it and played with it and played with it. And I finally figured it out. I should have set that down in the bottom first. That's soot. Soot stains like ink. Lots of fun. Anyway, I made this can. Just four holes in the top, four holes in the bottom. You can do it with a church key if you want. You can set this down right on top of it. Notice it's just a little bigger. That way it's not going to come off. And a piece of ceramic tile I'm going to let him have anyway. Anyway. Get it lit. Come on. Yeah, that ought to do it. Haha. <laughs> I bet it lights now. Alrighty. Yeah, I can see the fire inside. Okay, let's give her a turn. What I figured out the problem was this little joint right here come loose it would run like this for a second and then stop anyway there we go little old man merry christmas and many good things to you and yours hope you like the new stand burning pretty nice in there makes a little bit of smoke oh yeah oh yeah this little joint right here that tubing is. You can slide this out and clean your piston with some 97% alcohol if you need to. And that ought to take care of it. If it locks up, that's basically just dirt in there. Never oil that. Oil everything else. I'm Scott Brown with Green Wind and other home energies. Many good things to you and yours. The sterling engine. I was going to put a diaphragm on. This is, I guess, it's doing okay. It's, I wish for it to be a lot more efficient than this. I've got a couple other series coming out. I'm trying to do all my video editing first, and that way I can put these things out without that big old time gap like I have in the past. Look at that soot. Best way to clean soot is out in the wind with a dry paper towel. And then clean it. If you put soap and water on it, it becomes like a thick ink. Not much fun to play with. I didn't put any oil on it. No water in the top there. No ice. Well, the fire went out. She's going to slow right on down. Hope you enjoy, little old man. Many good things to you and your Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. First, the splicer moves first, then the piston. Oh. <laughs> Take care.